data and data analytics go and all those kinds of things like Power BI is really taking the uh, the world by storm and if people haven't had a chance to have a look at it and understand what it can do for their business I think that would be a really useful thing to do because the sort of things you can do with Power BI used to cost you know hundreds of thousands of dollars yeah, right. or millions of dollars you know not that long ago and with the pricing Microsoft has it's now like really accessible for even even very small businesses so I mean we use it internally for all of our reporting yeah um, and we, you know I mean we use it obviously for all clients you know from very small up to very large um, businesses that are certainly getting involved in this so it's a reporting solution um, we've also got a a budgeting forecasting solution which is based on Power BI as well so if you can do kind of graphical um, budgets and forecasts and so yep. on so there's all that side of things um, it's yeah once people see it they usually are like wow that looks that is amazing the hence the word yes, amazing. amazing exactly this is why we chose that word because yeah. it comes up all the time because if people get really excited by it they go wow this is incredible and this is amazing so they go yep that's what we want to do in our business so access analytics um i had a look at the website so it's coming up for 20 years right yes so have you got any sneaky plans in mind for what you might do well, for, for next year we've just been talking about that actually so yeah we're in the planning stages at the moment so it's sort of a watch this space at the moment but um yes we'll probably have something to announce about that fairly soon that's a pretty big um, achievement, really. Twenty years in business. Yeah. Um, we know a lot of businesses come and go. Yes. And um, yours has has um, survived and stuck around and thrived. So, what do you reckon <laughs> some of the reasons for that have been? Um, I think part of it is just persistence, really. So yes. you know, it's like like climbing a mountain. It's the yeah. same kind of thing. You know, there's so many opportunities where you could give up and you yep. want to give up. Yep. And, uh, it's a bit hard and a bit scary. Yeah, it's a yeah. bit hard, it's a bit scary, but you know. You've got your eyes shut for a lot of it. <laughs> sometimes. <laughs> yeah. yeah, exactly. Yeah. But you know, you just gotta kind of not be pig headed about it, but um, you do need to keep going, I think, is part of it. Just the, yeah. just the ones that are still here. <laughs> so the secret, secret to, to being a business is to stay in business, right? Exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly. Just keep doing what you're doing. So I think that's part of it. But, you know, I mean, Obviously, we wouldn't be in business if we hadn't gotten some help from some really great advisors along the way. Yeah. Um, and obviously, we worked with um, we worked, worked with you for I don't even know how many years uh, now. Five, six years. Yeah. Yeah. It's yeah. A long time. Yeah. Uh, and you know, various other advisors as well that, that makes a big difference. So, I think being able to take advice as well as um, you know, obviously we are advisors ourselves, yes. but being able to take advice is a really important thing. In, yeah. Don't know everything. Don't have all the answers. No. So you don't want to even pretend to. No. No. So Ooh. you love your photography. I and, do. And the travel and the the yes. um, experiences, the adventurous experiences that mm -hmm. you um, undertake all lend themselves really nicely to mm. do some good photography. Mm. Do that Thank on. you. They certainly do. So yeah, we produce a little calendar every year that has some photography. So we share that with a number of you know, clients and associates and so on. And um, just, well, hopefully in the next few months anyway, we'll, there was also a book that I've written, oh. which will have some photography in there as well. But it's a book about how to be, how to get into international training. Ah, and that's it right. Has some stories as well. As What's it called? Is adventures. it called How to Get Into International Training? <laughs> That's the byline. Is it called amazing? Someone told me that was too long, <laughs> so it's it's just called the traveling trainer. Traveling trainer. The well, traveling that's you. Trainer. I remember when you first yeah. told me that's what you wanted to do. Yeah. You said I really want to do more of this. Yeah. And um, and have that opportunity to yeah. to travel and and look at what's happened ten years on, and mm. and uh, it's exactly what you're doing. Yeah. And so now you've written the book. Yes. To educate others around how to do it. Exactly. Fantastic. Yeah. And when is that due for release? Probably co to coincide with your 20th birthday, I imagine. Oh, uh, we should be able to do that, I think. Oh, well, there's, well, now you've committed to it on, on <laughs> All camera. Right, it's so on it's camera gonna, now. It's going to okay. happen, mate. All right, deal. Fantastic. All right, I'll go and uh, kick my editor. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs>